from the fucking first episode. They've been building up these goddamn White Walkers in this fucking battle. Only to then be like, oh yeah, the White Walkers are fucking retarded. They're going to do the dumbest shit ever. And then, I, actually, m more so the, the people are fucking retarded. Yeah, let's throw all, all the Dothraki in the fucking front line. They all die within about five seconds. Like, literally all of them die. After that, the line gets broken immediately. And while there are some visually stunning moments, the visuals were the fucking thing that made me want to goddamn like the episode. But the more I think about the writing, the more I hate it. They fucking built up this prophecy of the Azor Ahai about Jon Snow. He's gonna get that fucking magic sword and he's gonna be the one to kill that motherfucking uh, Night, uh, Night King. And then it's fucking Arya who deus ex machina's him with the literal exact fucking move that Rey used in the fucking throne room scene of The Last Jedi. And just kills all the White Walkers. <laughs> Nobody of value fucking dies except for Beric and Theon, and who the fuck cared about them? Isn't it good, though, that they subverted your expectations? No, shut the fuck up! <laughs> we got three more episodes left, and the final boss is gonna be fucking Cersei. Fucking Daenerys is like, we've won the last- uh, the Great War, now we have to win the last war, and it's like, oh, great. We got three more fucking episodes of this bullshit, where we're having I had to deal with like John being like, so yeah, we're kind of like uh, related. Uh, we've been having incest. Can I be king now? Like fuck you. John's never cared about the fucking throne. His entire goddamn storyline has been about the fucking White Walkers, and now the White Walkers are dead, and he didn't even do anything to them. Fuck you. Oh my god, and the fucking shitty thing is, is the last two episodes were really good. Me and Mahler were so happy. We were like, fuck, it's good again. It's really fucking good again. And then this happened, and we were so happy for most of the episode, and then the end happened, and it's like, what the fuck did you do that for? And to top it all off, that fucking ice dragon with the blue fire, so it breathes the blue fire on the wall and blows the fucking thing up, but then... When John needs to hide behind a little fucking rock, the ice fire can't do shit. Wolf, you have amazing insight. Uh, Thoughts on Iron Man 3? It's shit. But not as shit as Game of Thrones Season 8, Episode 3! <laughs> Fuck that! Damn it! Ah, I fucking hate this show! You made me all invested, and then got me to this fucking point where all I wanted was to see John fucking complete his goddamn prophecy that he was brought back to life for in season six, but apparently the writers just fucking forgot about it. And now, Azor Ahai means fucking nothing. Stannis is even more useless than he's ever been to Wolf. Yes, but how do you really feel? I feel pissed! Fuck Game of Thrones. Fuck season eight. Fuck Dan and Dan and... Ah, oh, damn it. Fuck that episode. It pisses me the goddamn hell off. There is no possible fucking way that they can redeem themselves in the next three because who the fuck cares about Cersei? The most useless fucking bitch of the show. Way to make the biggest fucking plot line of the entire series useless because the whole point of the White Walkers was to show that the Game of Thrones is petty and useless and that they should stop bickering over retarded shit like that and fucking come together to fight a threat bigger than them. Well, now the threat that's bigger than them is fucking done and now they're gonna go back to arguing about dumb petty shit. Wolf, you're just mad George R.R. R. Martin is better than Tolkien. Tolkien would rape him and love it. <laughs> <laughs> Game of Thrones pulled a Mass Effect 3 ending, and that's the shitty thing! It's not even the ending! It's not even fucking done yet! <laughs> the fucking ending hasn't even happened, and it's already shit! How do you fuck up the best goddamn episode, or what should have been the best goddamn episode of the show? Like, visually, that episode was incredible. There were so many shots that were like, I want to make that my fucking wallpaper. The acting was stupendous, the effects were great. And then the story fucked it all up. It'll be okay, Wolf. Game of Thrones was lame anyways. Everything you love in care media-wise will die after getting demolished. I still love you. Game of Thrones was not always lame, you faggot. Game of Thrones is great for season one through four. It sucked in season five. Season six brought it all back together. Season seven was shit. And then season eight started good, and now it's all bad again. And it's... Why is it so hard for people to write a halfway decent story? Like, really, why is it so fucking hard for people to just 
fucking write a halfway consistent narrative. It is so simple. All you have to do is not be a fucking tard. But apparently that's too goddamn difficult. Like the one part that you need to get right and you just couldn't fucking do it. It's so simple. It's fucking ice zombies. All you need to do is just fucking be competent. God damn it. God fucking damn it. I needed to get that off my chest since last night. Chat, I love Wait, you as well. Wolf, if the average three-mile commute to the store takes 14 minutes, why does it take my dad 25 years to get cigarettes? Because your dad's never coming back.